Hello, I'm Jan Mulvey and you're watching the Red Men TV. Steve, what do you want to say after that? Mate, it's a bottom note. I think that's me done. I'm not, I don't know, mate, it's just like Liverpool spent £120 million in the summer, didn't we? Brad Jones is in goal, Cole Torre is playing centre-half, Raheem Sterling's a front of his and a striker. Lovren's on the pitch and he's a terrible, terrible defender. He's, he's just one of the worst buyers I've ever seen us have. He, he shouldn't he should go need the team ever again because he's yeah. crap. And I know it, it's mad because Liverpool, the difference was today, they, they were two average teams, I think. don't think they're that good either. Put the ball in the back of the net, it helps, doesn't it? And we just couldn't do it. It's just so, so disheartening now. And he's, he's tried a lot. He's tried, pretty, he's tried changing formation. He's tried different players. He's done pretty much he's changed his goal. He's changed everything. Nothing's working. I just don't know what the answer is now. Everything's pinning our hopes on when Daniel Sturridge is fit. When Daniel Sturridge is fit, if your pol- if, our, if that's our our way of thinking, if that's our, if that's Liverpool's policy or ma- the manager's what it, his plan is to get Daniel Sturridge fit, it's a bit of a really bad plan because yeah. he's always injured. Yeah. And I I just, I just don't know what what, he, what he's going to do or what he can do to change it. Sacking him, well, what does that achieve? Because this, that, that squad's still what it is. And it's just one thing coming, what are they going to do? I just don't know what to do, I don't dance anymore, mate. It's so disheartening that you can go to Old Trafford, create chances, which we did, and yeah. not even look like scoring any of them. I think the Balotelli chance that he put on the bar was the only one that I thought maybe. The other chance, it was, it was, it was bad. It, we've left, the problem is, we've left Raheem Sterling with the entire weight of the yeah. football club on his shoulders there. 20 year old kid, he's, t- he's played 100 games for Liverpool already, he's 20. He's not a striker, and that's that's what that's what we're hope uh, basing our hope on. And then I just don't, and then even like twenty million pound for the lads, and he comes on and plays left back. You know, Lalana twenty five million pound doesn't impact the game. It, it just it all stems away from the summer. They've had a terrible. In hindsight, I remember sitting on the couch and saying, you know, I'm fairly optimistic about it because I like Lalana and. Um, I'd heard good things of Mark, which I have without seeing much of him. Mm-hmm. Moreno, I thought I'd seen him and liked him. And the fringe signings, are you, you know, you you your full backs and like Emery Chan, who's a who's a young prospect, all look good. The centre half he's bought terrible. The centre forward he's bought can't score a goal. Yeah. The midfielder who's bought Lana, who look he always looks a good player. What's he delivering? Nothing. Yeah. They, and then Mark, which can't get on the pitch. There's eighteen million pounds worth of players that aren't do bringing nothing to Liverpool to win. We're, we're, we're relying on a 20 year old kid and that's about it and it's just not good enough is it well, it just isn't good enough and I don't, I, I'm not one to say you know throw everything out and throw a baby out with a bath water but I, I've got no answers so I couldn't sit here I couldn't sit here now and say do this do this and this and we'll be Bournemouth I don't know I can't think of nothing no that's really depressing yeah. sorry mate it's fine well, what's most that ironic is that Liverpool got a level oh, at the That's a good penalty! penalty. Pen. Free kick. Is it on the edge? It's, it's a, a fucking pen. pen, Liverpool! Steven Gerrard in 95. Oh.